Hello everybody, back with another video touched by an angel, Arts and Crafts. Um, wanted to show you guys how to turn a picture into an SVG on Inkscape. First step will be to upload Inkscape. Why is this thing? I'm trying to find a little more, move it. Um, Don't worry about that. But the first step is to open um, Inkscape. And you can either import your picture in or you can paste it in. I will um, control V, hold down the control button, button, drag your mouse outward from the corner arrow right here. We want to go to path, trace bitmap, make sure the gray is um, selected, uncheck smooth, check stack scans, and check remove background. Check live preview, and then click OK. So it grayed out and then it came back. So this box does not go away. So click the X. So now we want to drag the picture over delete our color picture. So now we'll just be working with this picture. So now let's go to object, ungroup. Now you can tell it's ungrouped because we have these little lines here. Click outside of the box or outside of the picture. Click it again and then we start to drag away. And so we are going to delete that one because it is not full picture. Going to hmm, it's not full, so I'm gonna. So you basically it's up to you what you like the best. So I'm gonna delete that one. I don't like that one. Possibly that one. So I'm gonna make that one smaller as possible. And you can change the colors on these. Um, so let's say we wanted that red. Turn that red. But I'm for now. I'm gonna turn it black. So that is a possible one. So we're looking for the cleanest line. See how the, because the Cricut will cut all of this stuff. So I'm not gonna use that one. Let's turn this black. See the lines are thicker in this, in this one than it is this one. So now I'm gonna delete that one. Move it up there, make it a little smaller. So now let's pull away some more. And our black, and let's compare that one against the other one. So again, the lines are a little thicker. So you could choose to use that one. And then as you pull more away, lines get thicker. Don't want that. There's another one, let's turn out one black. Other lines in this one compared to these two. Let's see. Mm, we have thicker lines. I think it's pretty good. So let's delete this one and let's delete this one. So well, for the second video, I'm just going to use that one. You just keep clicking and pressing delete. So we are going to use this. So let's say your picture has, let's say you want to get rid of these little specks on the picture because the Cricut is going to cut that out. So what we would do is go to our node. We would basically hover over it or drag your mouse over to make a box, release and hit delete. Oh, we don't want to move that. Okay. So, we want to go back. I'm going to drag curve. 
So this is basically what you do. So we can hit delete for that one. So you will just select the nodes and click delete. So let's go. And now we got rid of that line and there was another line. So also in the Cricut, you can slice these lines out. So let's say this is what we wanted. So we would shrink it, make it smaller. And you see it's, I haven't used the control because you can change size, right? So let's say we wanted to keep the picture proportion, then we just hit control and then we drag out, drag in. So let's put that there. Now we want to go to file, save as, and we want to save this as a plain SVG. So let's save it as two. Save. Now let's go to Cricut. Ready for Cricut to upload. We want to go to new project. So we want to go to upload, upload image, browse. So now I'm going to select my picture. Let's put it into box. Let's try it again. There it goes. Well, let me find it here. There we go. Open. And it's already ready for us. Go to, you can add tags, um, keep the name the same, and go to save. Now all we do, so it looks like it put that line in there from when we were in Inkscape. So basically you would delete that if that happened. See that line? But let's say I wanted to get rid of that line in here. I would just go to shapes. I would hit square, maybe. So I would go down. And I would just move this. And then I just flip like this and slice. Pull it apart. Delete. I can try a circle. Do it again. I would just go slice. Delete. Of course, next time in Inkscape, you'll just make sure you delete that line. So I'll just go like this. Now there's possible other ways to do this, but this is what I would do. Um, slice. Delete. Delete. And then you would just continue to keep doing that. Okay. So then we can make this smaller. Then what you would do is just go to make it. And there you go. Hope you guys found this video useful. 
please like and subscribe or please like the video and subscribe to my channel. Um, if you would like to join my craft group, please go to Learn Arts and Crafts with Touched by an Angel 36 on Facebook. Um, I do have Instagram as well, which is Touched by an Angel 36. Same thing with Facebook and my email, same thing. Um, it's Touched by an Angel 36 at um, gmail.com. Thank you all for watching my video and I hope you have a great day.